Hello, my name is Eva Koroma. I come from Stockholm University and I'm working with a project called ShareTech. Are you a teacher educator or an in-service teacher or perhaps a teacher student? In this movie I'm going to show you how to use our portal ShareTech where you can find open educational digital resources. ShareTech offers you a possibility to search and find and share digital resources. We have about 26,000 resources at the moment. ShareTech means sharing digital resources in the teaching education community. And this is a free year project co-funded by the European Communities eContent Plus program. ShareTech is devoted to improve a stronger digital culture in the teacher education field in Europe and to support the development of European perspective. This is what our portal looks like and I'm going to go out to the internet to show you how it works. You can start by clicking the take button. Instead of searching right now I would like to show you what kind of resources you can find here. So I click on the browse button and as you can see you can browse by different categories like collections, educational institutions that are involved in the project, teacher practice context, knowledge area and generic skills. Let's have a look what kind of knowledge areas we, get, we have on this portal. As you can see we cover a lot of different educational areas, computer science, geometry, physics, communication and so on. I go back to take button to show how to make a simple search. In this box I can write the search term ICT and teaching and I click the search button. Here are the results of the search and as you can see we have a more than 3000 hits. That's much too many to be convenient. So we can use the tool filter to filter the results. I click on the button show options here and you can see that we can filter by collection or language or format or what type of a resource we are looking after. I start by filtering by the language and I would like to have a resource in English so I click on that and the hits are reduced to 321 hits. I'm interested in teaching English so I look for some results in that area and here I find a home page which is rated with three stars. As you can see the system supports very many different social media tools so you can send this forward to your Facebook or Twitter. But I would like to read more about this so I click on the show more button and here I can read more about the, this resource in different languages. I choose English and you can read here more about it. If, if I think this is interesting I click on the link to the actual resource. And this seems to be a good and interesting web page about teaching English with ICT. I close this window and go back to the take button. In order to really experience the power of ShareTech you need to sign in. So you can gather your resources, you can comment, you can bookmark them, you can interact with other teachers in Europe and you get signed in directly if you register yourself here. As you can see you have some boxes to fill in 
and you can also fill in your areas of interest, which means that the system remembers that and always shows the results according to your profile. As I'm already a member, I will go back and sign in here. Now the system knows who I am and you can read here my Certec. If I do a search here, I get the hits according to my profile. Let's see what use button means. If I click on the use button. You can read here at, that we have about the 400 members right now and 25 groups of interest. You can search, browse and annotate the resources. The system recommends new resources for you according to your profile. You can bookmark or comment the profiles or rate them. And you can see what kind of groups of teachers there are and what are they discussing. And as you can see, you can also see your search history. If you click on viewed, you can see what type of resources you have found before. Let's have a look what kind of groups there are. Everyone mem who is member in this community can both join or create groups for discussion. And as you can see, many teacher groups are discussing web quests or mind mapping or communities of practice and so on. The last button is give and you are invited to share your resources with us or your opinions and experiences. Uh, you can either upload a resource to the system or you can link to it. If I click on the button upload, I get the form where I can fill in everything about the resource, the title and keywords and so on. Uh, ShareTech has created a help system. This is called RIC, a metadata system that helps us all to describe our resources in a proper way. So I sign out and, and here you have the contact information about our project. Here's the address to the portal and we have a little trailer on YouTube. So welcome to join the ShareTech community.